Good morning again. This is Tuesday, August 3rd, 2021. Not sure why I'm saying that, but there it is. I'm back while I wait on a previous video to upload. I just grabbed this deck from a pile, and this is by U.S. Games. It's called Heart and Hands Tarot by Liz Blackbird. And we're looking at the thumbnail I created for this video right there. On the left the Fool card. On the right's the book, which I'll show here in a second as soon as we turn the camera back on. So here we go. That's the bottom of the box that it comes in. <laughs> Here's the top of the box. I'm just going to lay the cards into the box. So hopefully you can see the box there. It's got the cutouts to make it easier to open. The inside's just a dark color. And that probably, if it focuses, so this is very new. It's 2021 by U.S. Games, made in China, which appears to delay everything, at least nowadays. Probably always has, always will, probably. But the book is about 71 pages, I think. There's the book. So you got that. I think it's 71. I can I have a little hole that I'm reaching into, which explains the odd movements a little bit. It says the person, Liz, was a contributor to the Pride Tarot. I don't know if I've seen that, but maybe. But anyway, there aren't any pictures of the cards in here, and this is a black and white deck. I seem to have a thing for black and white decks. There's another one I got from them recently. So we'll see how this goes if I just allow those two things to be in the picture along with the cards. If it's too much, then I'll I'll take them out. And these cards are a little bit bigger. Here's the backs, which uh, looks reversible to me. So let's start with the Fool. I'll just lay it there, kind of a zoom in. And then we'll put it into, feed these into the box. Uh, I might be able to zoom in just a bit more. Give me a second and pardon my hand in the way. That's the hair. There, I think that's a little better. See if I can make it brighter. I think that's good for black and white. Here comes the magician. I'll read these just in case, but I think they're pretty easy to read. The number can be a little challenging to find sometimes. You see on his hat there's a one, and then compare that to, say, here in the high priestess. But I think most of them, I think... Most of them are in the usual spot near the top of the card. I guess I can put it that way, near the top of the card as I flip through them, yeah. So there's that. Here's the Empress. The Emperor. Doing that whole garage door thing must have got me into showing cards again. I don't know what's up today. The Hierophant. The Lovers, the Chariot, uh, look at her hair, huh. Justice, hmm. the Hermit, The Wheel of Fortune. Strength. The Hanged Man all wrapped up. Like a mummy. Death, uh, the moth again. See that a lot. Temperance. Hmm. That's interesting. The devil. The 
the tower. Hmm. I could look at that one a bit more, I think. Huh. The star. The moon. Hmm. Fish. The sun. Judgment. I'll try to speed up some. The world. Uh, 21. Notice no Roman numerals, just regular number numbers. Whoops. The order isn't the order that I would show them in. So I've got to take a second to correct that. Bear with me. Sorry about that. Here, here we go, almost. Mm -hmm. There we go. Okay. Here come the wands. I'm guessing they're calling it that. I gotta look ahead again. Sorry. Yep, wands. And of course, you could pause the video to look at something, but I try to give a few seconds to each one because it's not that easy to pause, you know. It depends on what you're using to watch the video, I mean. So let's see what they have for the court card here in the wands. It's Princess of Wands. Prince of Wands, the Queen of Wands, the King of Wands, and here come the Cups, sorry. There's a little opening needs to be bigger. It's like a light box, but it doesn't work so good. If I turn the light on, this little thing would turn blue. So there was money down the drain. Not much. Princess of Cups. Prince of Cups. Queen of Cups. The King of Cups. The uh, swords, hmm. I find that one interesting. Hmm. So sorry, I may pause sometimes. I've looked at this a couple times, but not in this kind of light, that's for sure. So hopefully the detail is clear. I mean, it's black and white and kind of line art or whatever they call it now. Princess of Swords, the Prince of Swords. That looks familiar. Queen of Swords, King of Swords. Hmm. Okay, last but not least, the Pentacles. Uh, that's interesting too. Huh. The three. Wow. Princess of Pentacles. Hmm. Prince of Pentacles. Nice tie. 
Queen of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles. Let that go for a little bit. Then I'll try to put the box cover on and maybe zoom out some. Hold on while I zoom out. There we go. I think that's going to get the whole box cover. And then I'll put the thing back on. Maybe it didn't zoom out enough. Yeah, it's enough to see the whole picture. So with that, hopefully that was short enough. These are always longer this way, one card at a time. But that's okay. I think it's clear. I might only occasionally do the other and, and going forward. So with that, I will say peace and thanks for watching and all of those things. Bye.